Yo, what up everyone? This is Gizmo GX and welcome to the first video of 2021. Actually, I had to pause for that pause for a second because I honestly forgot if we were in 2121 or we were in 2020 and I was just pondering so much stuff. You know, this is my first video I've I've done in like over a month because of the secret project that will be a short clip at the end of this video. So stay tuned for that. So yeah, it's been a while since I recorded. I really need to do an update video. <laughs> I really do. I need to do a lot of stuff. And as a matter of fact, this battle in particular that I'm doing, as the title says, it's a what if battle. What if I did win the first uh, weeks of playoffs and Goki did as well? Spoilers alert. So hopefully this battle, if it did took place, this is how it would probably in a way it would have turned out so this is my squad that i'm rocking and honestly i'm kind of terrified because today we're taking on goki gamer our old pal friend soling versus partner our partner in truth and crime you know you know i, I probably butchered that already but yeah today we're going up against the milwaukee medichams <laughs> i hope I, I did not butcher that name whatsoever if i did goki my bad it's been a minute i'm trying to get better at commentary over here so let's go ahead i don't want to keep my brother holding up anymore because i have been holding up for a very long time now in terms of battle music i'm gonna be honest with y'all uh, I don't know if I'm gonna keep the gameplay since I'm I am recording the gameplay audio, and I don't know if I'm gonna choose this or some other OSTs like I've did in the RCF. Not too certain how I'm gonna do that. So, anyways, I'm probably just gonna go with maybe random because why the heck not? I'm just random as as it is. So I'm I'm kind of curious what my boy Goki's got in store for us. So. As I always like to say on every single, I think I mentioned this in the RCF, this guy is my rival, my true rival, no matter what, <laughs> this guy, I need to destroy him. Now, as you can see on this screen, my boy has a tough team. He has pure legendaries, pure freaking legendaries, and I'm just freaking fed up with that. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I mean, I took in this team in a, in a version of it with uh, Arsenal MC. I took in a version of this team. Now, I had uh, quite a few ideas of what he was going to bring on, and he pretty much brought what I thought, at least three of them. The ones that I did predict was Tapu Koko, the Kirin Black, and Heatran. I knew those three were going to come. Now, as for the rest of his mons, by the way that we've been always, like, team building together, I know that Haxorus has first impression. I know that Gollisopod has first impression, because why the heck he would not? So... Already, he has a lot of threats. Yeah, there's so many things that I need to be aware of. And I feel like, personally, he thinks I might be leading out with Garfield. But, actually, I'm going to lead out with Frankie. I'm going to be real with y'all. I, I kind of planned this off screen. And I knew that he might think I'd be leading into Garfield. Because, it, I mean, it's kind of the obvious choice over here. So, I'm just going to go ahead and lead off with this. And his team is built off a lot of legendaries and we're kind of I'm kind of afraid here and the way that I built off this team was mo mostly I only focus so little on the defensive side and more on the offense side as you can see on our opponent's side it is just pure offense he could go either defensive or offensive it just doesn't matter and wow <laughs> I put off a pretty good lead so he led off with Haxorus, a pretty, pretty bold play on his part. He might have predicted that I got into Cinderace, but you know what? I ain't dealing with that crap, bruh. I ain't dealing with that crap. So I'm going to go ahead and set up my Stealth Rock because if I could set up the Stealth Rock boldly enough, then I could probably chip away the rest of his team with Lincoln Rock. To, to be frankly honest, the only one I don't think, I think the Mon that I'll be having the most trouble with is gonna be golly Sapat because golly Sapat is just beyond hideous terrifying i'm just i'm just afraid of it <laughs> i'm gonna be honest so i'm just gonna hold, go ahead and go for the stealth rock he might go for the taunt so i'm just gonna pick up my moves as fast as possible because i really don't want to go ahead and 3.41 pie ah it is this bro okay so we're gonna he brings in the Appleton. Is this is gonna be his G Max? Hmm. I wonder what it might be. 
I really never faced Pi 3.14. I really don't know what that means at all. I really don't know what Appleton has in store. I've had Dragon types in the past and Appleton, at least in this form, I'm not sure what it's capable of. And the way that it's, it's got me, let's see, do I have anyone that I really had to be worried about? Hmm. I really don't know. Hmm. Uh, really don't know what to expect from this guy. Mm, I want to go for the toxin and see what that happens. Maybe it has immunity? I don't know what to expect from this thing. To be frankly honest, it probably a tank? Something? It has a grass type move? What does Apple Acid do? Oh. 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 It lowers special defensive. So I'm assuming Apple Acid hits on the special defensive side. Hmm. So it, it hit me on the grass area. Hmm. He might go for the Apple Acid again. Hmm. Interesting. So now that knowing that Haxorus is a thing here. Hmm. Mm. I really left Frankie out here out in the open so mm, I'm just gonna slack it off and honestly this is probably the baddest play I did but I really don't know what to do um, actually actually Actually, hmm, if Apple Acid hits on the special defensive side, I wonder if I could do this. Hmm, I'm trying to think what mods does he have on his side that I should be a, a very, very afraid of. Hmm, I kind of want to bring in. I'm gonna be honest with you, I kinda wanna bring in Ushio and let's see if I can get an early in sweep. If I could do this, this is gonna be very big. So I'm gonna go ahead and call mine and see if I could pull it off. <sighs> maybe, maybe I could do it. <sighs> But anyways, uh, so going on with the commentary with this video. Okay, so what, what is he going to do? What is going to do? I'm going to go for Calm Mind. He could go for Apple Acid. Maybe there's Clear Smog Appleton in here. I really don't know what to expect here. Hmm. Hmm. So Jirachi is built to be literally, literally, he is built to be like, to take hits. So I'm call mining max defense, max HP. I'm just gonna go for the call mine. He might have something like clear smog or something up on his hand, something that could definitely just negate this Jirachi altogether. And that is what kind of just terrifies me on its own. So with a plus two, hmm. Okay. So with that, he. Uh, this Appleton just leeched to me. Hmm. So I'm really out of shape on this. I really don't know what to say. Uh, I don't know if plus two Jirachi really has it in store. So I'm just going to look at its stats real quick. I did build this up so that it could just one shot a lot of things. But due to its special attack and its nature, it really it's not going to do what I really wanted to do. So I'm just going to go ahead and psychic. And that's pretty much it. All I'm going to do. I'm just going to Psychic. That's all I'm going to do. Psychic and hopefully it kills. Might not been the best of plays. Yeah, it is not what I really wanted. Jeez. Okay, this is really bad. Hmm. Is Appleton really that tanky or I'm just... Hmm. Not what I really thought would have happened. Hmm. May have miscalculated that. <laughs> Your boy may have just miscalculated that. Oh. Okay. 
So here's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna call mine real quick one last time and just hope for the best here. So we're gonna call mine and that's all I'm gonna do. And I know first impression is gonna come in clutch here. Uh, I re it, re it really just... Hmm. Apple Acid, I think that negates me back to normal. I should just be having normal damage. I believe... Uh, first impression should be able to kill me off from here. But not sure. Not 100% sure. Again, I am not 100% sure about that. But anyways, if you guys have not looked at my nicknames, let me know in the comment section below. What are your thoughts on that? Of what the animes are coming from? Like, for example, Ushio that Jirachi is named after. Um, I'll give you a couple seconds. Maybe five. Maybe by the time he chooses the next Mon, then I'll give you an idea of what this Mon was based off of on. So we got this core. Huh. Alright. So we got Jirachi. Wow. Hmm. Alright. Hmm. Honestly, I'm just gonna go to Aqua. Do I really need Jirachi? I, <laughs> I'm gonna be frank with y'all. Do I really need this Jirachi? I really don't. <laughs> I'm gonna be frank with y'all. <laughs> I really don't need this Jirachi. Jeez, man. I guess I'll just see what. Wait, let me see. This lower special tag, this special defense. I, I really don't need Jirachi. So I'm just gonna go ahead and just go Psychic and just go for it. Oh, a he actually is faster than me. This Jirachi is actually faster than me. Huh. I didn't think that I didn't think that one through. So I wonder if this thing is Choice Scarf. So I have 60 seconds. Might as well just speed it up. So I'm just gonna go with Garfield and see what's up. So I'm gonna go and go Garfield and... Just gonna go Hydro Kick and just risk it for the Biscuit. So looking at my team, I know I said that in the next turn I was going to say what Ushio's uh, background is in terms of anime. This is from Clanad. If you guys have not checked out Clanad, this is a very, a very, very heartwarming anime that I definitely recommend people. If you guys are suckers for rom kind of like romance, but at the same time you want to cry. Yeah, Clanad is your boy. Now let's go into moving on to Garfield's little backstory. So we're going to go ahead and I jump kick because why the frick not? Eruption is just gonna kill lives. It is choice scarfed. I just clarified it. It is choice scarfed So did I miss did I miss am I going to miss? Are you going to miss? No, you're not gonna miss I kill off core core is gone Thank the gods. I kill at least one mon. I actually that makes it two Now that I think about it. Yeah, that makes two mons that are dead Whew all right, we got Coco. Coco is what I believe to be the Tapu Coco. Jeez, what was I planning to have for this thing? Don't know, and kind of frankly, I'm just a bit afraid as as it is. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Don't have really many options for this thing. I have a feeling that first impression is just gonna kill me here. Well, I don't have a feeling like that's gonna happen. Hmm. Actually, first impression might just kill me from here. Oh. <laughs> first impression might actually just kill me here. All right, we're gonna go in Aqua real quick. I know this is kind of stupid, but I'm gonna go in Aqua. <laughs> I'm going to Aqua. I'm sorry, Aqua. Also, Garfield's uh. Anime backstory is to RE0. Thought I mentioned that one. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna die. <laughs> I really I was really backed into a corner and I feel like I feel like Suicune would have had uh <laughs> I really would have had a, a run a run for his money. I'm gonna be really frankly honest with y'all. I'm gonna bring in Gandora, the Dragon of Destruction. But before I pick my move, and I think he might swap out. And if he does swap out, then unfortunately I have to go G Max this this following turn. 
So first off, Garfield's backstory real quick is to RE0 as I mentioned before. Beautiful anime. I I, I mean, I want to, it's not beautiful. I just want to say it's pretty good anime. It's about, I'm not going to spoil it into much into detail, but it's about a character who just dies over and has like a redo pretty much. Now Aqua, Konosuba, <laughs> oh my god. If you're into the pervy stuff and the pervy jokes, it, this is your anime. Now for Frankie, there wasn't really much about him. I really didn't get to use him to the fullest of potential, but his backs, oh my god, I did not think that through. Okay, let's just flash cannon and hope for the best here. So flash cannon and let's just do this. And did we manage to kill out Coco? Yes, we did kill off the Coco. So my bet on that. So Frankie, where are my One Piece fans? Where are my One Piece fans? Yes, that that is where the Frankie nickname comes from. So there's that. Now for Gandora, this one, if you bring, if this name rings about to you in whatever form, then you are on track, my boys. You guys are on track because it is supposed to ring a bell. All right. Oh God. Um. Hmm. Yikes. Um. Hmm. I kind of, I kind of want to know if I can take a hit here. If I can go G Max, I, I, I want to know this. I kind of want to know this. Can I outspeed a Haxorus? I know naturally Derulodon does not outspeed Haxorus, but for whatever reason, if I could pull off a whatever Derulodon shenanigans here and manage to pick up a kill here, I, I would gladly do it. But I feel like first impression might be a thing. Gandora, can you prove to be? No, nah, you're not. No, nah. <laughs> you're not Gandora. I'm so sorry, my boy. I'm so sorry. You're not Gandora. Well, actually, yes, you are. You are Gandora, the dragon of destruction. If that does not ring a bell, then <laughs> I don't know what else to say to give you more hints on the anime reference for this one. I mean, can you really consider it anime? I mean, I'm gonna shut it out. It is from Yu-Gi-Oh. It's probably like the last arc of Yu-Gi-Oh, like the original series. It's when Yugi, like young Yugi Moto, or I should say present Yugi Moto, uh, reveals. Ooh. Oh, shoot. All right. This is really getting very intense. I'm running out of time. So I'm just going to go ahead and just go for G Max Depletion and hope for the best here. So let's go for the best. Let's go. D can I can I pull something off out of my butt? Can I pull something out of my butt? <laughs> I don't think I can. I don't think I can. <laughs> if he D dances, I'm in trouble. If he D dances, I'm in trouble. <laughs> oh, I actually outspeed. <laughs> but is it enough to kill? It is. It is. <laughs> oh my god. It is enough to pick up the kill. Oh my goodness. <laughs> This is why my boy Gandora deserves its name. Gandora, the dragon of utter destruction. So here it goes. Well, I, I want to say Max Lightning would be way more effective. And uh, I might as well just go for Max Lightning and just hope that that just kills. I feel like it should do more. I don't know. First impression? J just go for it. It, it, it actually kills. Wow. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> then, th ladies and gentlemen, this is why I love to roll out on Kandora, the dragon of destruction. <laughs> I three oldest man. <laughs> what man is, is this? <laughs> I just really want to say the quotes like Gandora, the dragon of destruction. <laughs> I should I should include that in this clip. But anyways, as I mentioned at the beginning of the video, there is a secret trailer, in a way, a secret trailer or opening to the next following series that will be going up tomorrow on this channel. As this video is being recorded on a Saturday, but the video will be uploaded on a Sunday, so the series should be starting on Monday, which I won't spoil it. 
but definitely go ahead and just wait don't click out of the video just yet but also definitely go ahead and check out goki's point of view of this battle because i'm really curious of what his thoughts in were i i thought he had this bag and this battle in the bag to be to be frankly honest i thought he had this battle in the bag but you know what drew not just proven to be a monster I, just a straight monster here just a straight beautiful freaking monster and i'm just can't be more proud of Darudon. i mean rcf i enjoy it so with that being said i hope you guys enjoyed this video definitely go ahead and check check out goki's side and just wait a little bit and you'll see a special teaser trailer for the following series i'll be releasing on monday so with that being said this is big gizmo gx and i'll see you on that special series peace Yo!